Hello everyone, it's Mr. Anthony here again. This is um, how to divide by 10, 100 and 1000. You might have just seen the other video about how to multiply by 10, 100 and 1000. This is how to divide by those. Now, instead of making things 10 times bigger, when you're dividing, it's making things 10 times, 100 times, 1000 times smaller. So instead of taking things to the left hand side, we're actually gonna go to the right hand side. So to start off, I'm just using the number 5,000. So I've got my five and my thousands. I've got my hundreds, tens of units with a placeholder. So if we divide by um, 10 first, everything is going to take one step to the right. Not just a five, but all our placeholders will move as well. So our five would actually go into our hundreds if we divide them by 10. And then you need two placeholders, one in your tens, one in your units. So dividing by 10 is just one step to the right hand side. If you were dividing by 100, it would be two steps. So it would go into the hundreds column first and then into our thousands column. So into our tens column, sorry. So that will become a 50. So then you put the zero with it to make sure that you've got the final answer. If it's dividing by a thousand, it is going to be three steps to the right hand side. So our five starts off in our thousands, goes into our hundreds, then into our tens, and then into our units to give you five. Now, same again with decimals. If we started with our five in our um, units column, if we divided by 10, what would happen is it would jump over where the decimal point is into our tenths column. Now, the only difference with this is, is we need to make sure our decimal points put in and our placeholder this time will go into our units column to show that it would be 0.5.